Hey, fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and those cross watching, welcome to your tarot love messages here. Today, we're going to take a look at and see what is it that the universe wants you to know at this particular point in time, maybe about your current your situation, your emotional state, about you know who or what is coming into your life here. So, we'll see what messages the universe or tarot guides are trying to communicate with you here. Also, uh, just a reminder that this is going to be a general reading, guys, so please just keep mindful of that. If you're after a personalized tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address just below the video here. So we'll see what the universe wants you to know about your current state or your, even your current emotional state here. Bottom of the deck, you have the Hermit energy here, okay? And the Hermit tells us that you are currently on your journey. You are on your path here, okay? Um, the very people that you're currently meeting or connected with, the very circumstances uh, in your life that you're attracting, now, this is all a part of your journey, okay? It's all a part of your journey. They're here to help you. Circumstances here are, are here to propel you here. Some of you are doing a lot of soul searching. You're spending a lot of time on your own. Some of you, you know, there's a lot of inner guidance that's coming from within you here. Now, this is a path that, the path that you're on is a path of self-discovery. And this path is going to help you become more in tune with your higher self and you're going to reach a more heightened sense of awareness so whatever it is that you guys are currently doing and that you know has helped you put yourself onto this path here keep going it feels like you're on the right track okay so if you're meditating if you're practicing self-relaxation techniques if you're reading books here um, mantras um, positive affirmations Whatever it is that you're doing, it's clearly working for you, so keep going with it here. Um, over the next couple of weeks or even months, I feel like you could be drawing your energy inwards here, and a lot of the answers that you're currently seeking, whether subconsciously or consciously, are within you here. You're also coming to an awareness, a realization of a very profound truth here, so, and to me, it feels like you're no longer being affected by distractions in the outside world. Now, for some of you, I see you possibly as part of this journey of self-discovery and part of this hermit mode energy, you pulling inwards um, and you spending more time on your own. It might just be a good time for you to go on a weekend getaway or a weekend retreat, um, even see if you can visit like a sacred pilgrimage site anything where you can sort of contemplate you know your your motivations your personal values and allow you to get more closer to your authentic and true self some of you the hermit i think is like an invitation to retreat into your private world now you don't have to you know you don't have to have you don't need to go on a weekend retreat or you don't need to get away maybe you just need to learn to Maybe you just need to isolate and seclude yourself. You know, it, it's, or maybe you need to take a journey or spend more time with like a small, much smaller intimate group of people. Just allow yourself to be more in tune with your inner guidance here, yeah? your inner voice. You need to take it one step at a time because it feels like right now you're at a very pivotal point in your life where. Some of you are considering taking a new direction. Be patient with yourself because a lot of you are reevaluating your personal goals. You're looking at your life with a more deeper, more spiritual understanding. 
over the next weeks, months, your priorities are definitely going to shift and change as a result of this hermit mode because it represents this desire to turn away from you know this consumerist or this materialistic society that we have got going on today and focus more on your inner world your inner self your inner voice okay um the answers that you're seeking here guys are within you and you can only really know them if you still yourself quiet yourself and find solitude here Now, with the Nine of Cups, I feel like this is you enjoying life's pleasures here, okay? This is you enjoying a wish come true, a manifestation, you being very grateful for where you are at and who you're with. Um, it represents this energy that carries out, allows you to carry out your deepest desires here. I feel your heart is overflowing or will be overflowing with a lot of joy a lot of happiness and a lot of appreciation for the person that you are the person that you're becoming the people that you're with okay and if you don't feel yourself quite there yet allow yourself to enter that space okay where you're basking in the abundance of life and just experiencing all the emotions that come with this joy and this intensity and this pleasure take it also as a sign from the universe that things are lining up for you things that you're wishing for are coming to fruition it's an energy where i feel like soon enough i, I just feel like you could not be happier you could not be happier with the results with yourself here some of you are patiently waiting for a wish to come true or a wish to come to fruition Okay, if you've been patiently waiting to manifest someone or manifest something here, then this is a wonderful energy here because it's an excellent omen that a wish will soon be granted, a wish will soon be fulfilled. Now with the Page of Cups, I feel like it's a bit of an invitation to enjoy and to splurge okay, on yourself. So you will also, because pages are messengers, you will also be receiving an unexpected message or an unexpected surprise it could come from the universe it could come through it could come through like from another person here from a romantic interest here from a stranger it could be an intuitive message it could come from within you your inner voice here right so it feels like there's something comes out of the blue but there's a catch there's always a catch right and only when you're open to receiving it will you actually receive the full message here. So an opportunity comes to you out of the blue, but you need to be able to be in a position where you're ready to receive this opportunity. Okay, um, And it's up to you. It's up to you here. Try and stay really remain open here. Anything can happen, anything is possible here. Yes, even a fish popping its head out of a chalice. Anything is possible. Okay, your wishes can come true. You can manifest the life you've always wanted, the dream job you've always wanted, that dream partner, that you know, ideal romantic connection that you've always wanted. Learn to open your mind to all possibilities. And the universe will reward you and you will become pleasantly surprised. Start exploring the magic of your fullest potential, even if it doesn't seem within reach. Um, the Page of Cups is an energy that asks you to embrace and believe that anything is possible. Because it is. It absolutely is. Speaking of anything being possible here, there's you're going to be... Some of you are going to be wearing a heart on your uh, sleeve here. And I'm also seeing that be open to possibilities because I feel like there is, in the not so distant future, there is a beautiful reconciliation or a beautiful reconnection or an engagement or a celebration or a wedding or a marriage here. It's you. It's your energy. There's someone here that's waiting for you down the altar. That's someone here that's ready to consume you. Um, there's a happiness and a bliss that you're going to find yourself in. Um, how will you get there? I'll tell you how. By trusting your intuition and going with the magic of the flow. 
Okay, and these are your messages, guys. Thanks as always for watching and listening. Please show your support by liking, sharing, subscribing to the channel. For those of you interested in the reading, please feel free to connect. Otherwise, bye for now.